www.radiosnobs.com G'day, I'm Roger from Caldroy. I'm here to talk to you about some common issues regarding the installation of security screen door locks. First, we're going to check the lock and make sure it works without any issues. First of all, open the door. Once the door is open, press on the trigger and the tongue will extend. From there, we will activate the handle a few times. This ensures the lock and handle is working. Always remember to push the tongue in after each operation. Turn the key. This will activate the top and bottom slaves. Complete this step a few times to ensure, when using the key, the slaves will operate. Repeat the same operation with the snib this time to ensure the main lock and slaves operate. So this part of the lock is functioning correct. We'll now move on to the slaves and door installation. So what we've done is just gone through a series of tests to ensure the locking mechanism is working correctly. Let's move on to installation. With the tongue extended, we're closing the door up against the jam and the striker. From there we will then mark where the tongue and the striker meet. Repeat the same method for the top and bottom slaves. So we have our markings and we've got to line it up. See the bottom space? It catches within that space there, so we know that one is safe. The next marking is up higher, but still comes within the keep space. Repeat the same step for the top and bottom. And you can see it's catching about there. The bottom part's good, and so is the top part. And same for the bottom. We can see it sits within the keep, top and bottom. Now that we've determined all three locking points are working correctly, let's move on to the next step. Close the door and measure the gap space. The gap needs to be three to five millimeters. As the door closes, the lock bolt trigger striking the plate should activate the lock bolt projection. The minimum depth needs to be about 18 millimeters. Here, we've got it up to 21. We're also gonna measure the top and bottoms. Do the gall corners to find out. If you've just gone through some of the main points of the security door, hopefully we have resolved your issue.